Hi guys, this is an instructional video um, to show you the exercises that we're doing on week two of our Zoom sessions with the development centres. So we'll go through how to practice the skills, we'll go through the different skills, and this one is for the older group. Okay, so the warm up that we're doing with week two of the sessions is a bit of a continuation from week one, working around our um, marching exercises then into our dynamics similar to our dynamic warm-up so that we're working in a similar way with the shadow squad and how we warm up at fixtures so just to start with gonna march on the spot okay so on the balls of your feet get your arms working nice and easy okay then progress into marching and off Opposite hand to opposite inside of the foot, like that, just stretching out your groins, then outside, working on your hips. So same hand, same foot, right and right, left and left. Good, and clapping under the legs. Good, and next. Just split steps like that, one foot forward, one foot back. Good, and then open the gate, side to side, nice and easy. Just marching, easy, easy, and then close the gate, close the gate. Again, hips and groin, nice and easy, nice and smooth, not too difficult. Into more dynamics now, so we're jogging. skip and bring our knees up at the front and to the insides still with that skip and that bounce good and then to the outside Clapping the legs with a little bit of a skip. Good, and then feet backwards and forwards, and upper body twists. And then open the gate with those little steps, a little bit more rhythm in between. Same, close the gate. Step, step, close the gate, step, step, close the gate. Move around like that. Okay, so with all the skills, we're gonna work for a minute. Should be 20 seconds, sort of marching, easy pace, just getting the move right. Then it should be 20 seconds building up the speed, and then 20 seconds as fast as you can at the end. Okay, so we're gonna go through all the skills that the older group are gonna do, and the theme for these sessions is Brazilian footwork. So, first one is gonna to be toe touch, uh, sorry, quick feet, which is tapping the ball side to side. So, nice and easy for the first 20 seconds. I'll run through three or four of the exercises, how you need to do them, and then I'll show you the other exercises, and you can work for the minute yourselves. So, we're on the first 20 seconds, so, Nice and easy, just getting comfortable on the skill. Now I'm gonna get a little bit faster for the next 20 as my confidence grows. And then I'm building up to the last, last 20 seconds. Three, two, one, go. So fast as you can, fast feet, fast feet, fast feet. As many touches as you can, as many touches as you can. Nice and low, nice and low to the ground. And then hold it there as we move on to the next skill, which is gonna to be toe touches. So start with a march, just bring your opposite arm up, just getting that hip to lip, which is good for your speed anyway. So you're just getting into a march for the first 20 seconds, getting the skill right. 
and build it into a bit of a jog. Just getting that tempo up a little bit. And then on three, two, one, for the last 20 seconds, you're gonna go fast as you can. So three, two, one, go. Really push and then hold it there. So, next skill, roll back laces, alternate feet. So you're gonna get comfortable, again, marching, first 20 seconds, getting comfortable with the skill. Then next 20 seconds, just building it up. Oh, watching the clock there a little bit. Need to get a little bit more comfortable on the skill myself. Okay, and then same again, last 20, three, two, one, go. Might be better to do this being bare feet or with shoes if you've got a hard floor. And stop there. So, you get the idea on how to work on the skills. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to run through the skills that you need to work on and you need to practice because the idea of coming back to these videos is if in the session you haven't quite <clears throat> mastered the skill or you want to see it again, so you can master it, then here it is. So, the next skill for the older group is weak foot rollback laces, so it's just one foot. For me, my left is my best, so I would work on my right. And again, first 20 seconds would be just getting comfortable, pushing it backwards, pushing it forwards, then getting a bit more of a rhythm, more of a skip, and then push, 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 push for the last 20, okay? Next skill after that is roll, roll. And again, I would start that with a march for the first 20 seconds. Then progress it to a jog and I'm flicking the ball in keeping my feet to the outside nice and balanced and then last 20 seconds flicking it flick 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 really fast okay progressing from that the next skill is roll roll Socrates working on the spot roll roll Socrates so two rolls and then a Socrates two rolls and a Socrates so I'm doing Alternate feet on the Socrates. Okay, so now that the movement's getting more comfortable, now start to do it with a bit more of a rhythm, a bit more speed, and then the last 20 seconds would be as fast as I can. And I might be making mistakes, which is okay. Next skill moving on from that is a left foot Socrates, right foot roll, and repeating that again and again, again. Start with a march, start just getting the pattern right, which I need to improve a little bit there. Then a little bit more of a skip. And then the last 20 seconds, fast as fast as I can. Skill after that is right foot Socrates, left foot roll. Again, march. And then skip in like a bit of a jog, a bit more dynamic. And then last 20 seconds would be fast, fast, fast fast as I can. So I'm really putting myself under pressure. Next would be a one minute drink break. You, um, you make sure you had a chance to have a drink guys. If you're working through this, you don't need to necessarily have a drink. You might be just doing some of the skills that you, you need to catch up on. If 
you're doing the full session, have a drink. And then first skill back after the drink, we're gonna go into some step over skills. So it's gonna be step over, step over is the skill. Step over, step over, step over, step over. And we did this week one on the step over turn. So step over, uncross your feet, step over, uncross your feet. So again, you progress into a jog and then last 20, fast as you can, fast as you can, fast as you can. Progressing from that step over, we're now gonna use those step overs, but into a Ronaldo. So Ronaldo is roll the one foot, step over with the other foot, roll the other foot, step over with the other foot. So left, right, right, left, left, right, right, left, like that. Okay, so again, march doing your alternate feet Ronaldos, not coming out of your space, not coming out of your area. And then a little bit more of a jog. And last 20 seconds. As fast as you can, really turning those hips, getting it all working side to side. Keeping on with the step over theme, the next skill is now the Rivellino. So it's left step over, left outside, right step over, right outside. Step over outside, step over outside. Step over outside, step over outside. Okay, so again, march, march. A little bit more spring, a little bit more spring. And then, as fast as you can, last 20 seconds. All right, so now using those step overs and a combination of the Socrates, the next skill is a right foot Socrates and a left foot Ronaldo, working the ball side to side. So, right Socrates, left Ronaldo, right Socrates, left Ronaldo. And again, build that up, same way as before. 20 seconds getting used to it and then 20 seconds building up the speed 20 seconds as fast as you can so we go from that skill onto the reverse so it's now a left foot socrates and a right foot ronaldo left foot socrates right foot ronaldo working the ball side to side next skill after that is left foot elastic, right foot stop. So elastic, roll your foot to the outside of the ball and flick it in with your big toe. Stop with your right foot on top of the ball. Again, march, march, march. A little bit more of a skip, a little bit more of a skip. And then fast, 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 fast. Almost running onto the ball like that, all right? Similar with the left elastic stop. Now moving on to right foot elastic, left foot stop. So that's the pattern. Again, march, build up the speed, and then fast as you can the last 20 seconds. Skill after that, similar to our step over, but it's a Zico. So instead of stepping over the ball, you're gonna do a skill on the ball using the sole, and it's roll, stop it with the outside. And then if you saw that foot, it did that to uncross, so I'm back to being balanced. Cross my feet, uncross, cross, uncross, march, march, and then a bit more dynamic, a bit more dynamic, a bit more dynamic, and then fast as I can at the end. Okay, so that's how I build that one up 20 seconds, 20 seconds, 20 seconds as normal. And then Next skill, we've done step overs, we're now gonna do scissors, which is the opposite. So scissor, 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 scissor. So again, marching, first 20 seconds, just get the pattern right. Working onto the balls of my feet, getting nice and low. Okay, now that I've gone through the marching, it's with a jog, and then same as before, last 20 seconds, fast as I can, run out of feet. Okay. Final set of skills are based on something called the Falcao, 
which is like a Ronaldo, but you don't put your foot down. So it's going to be right foot, foul cow, left foot, roll. So right foot to roll, wave your foot over, roll it back with the sole, right foul cow, left roll. So if you watch my left foot, it doesn't touch the floor, comes back, comes back, comes back, comes back. Okay, so again, 20 seconds to build that up. Because it's a technical skill, you might spend the whole minute just mastering that skill. If you can do it already, then even better, then you can progress the speed. Next skill after that is left foot foul cow, right roll. Okay, again, wave it over the ball and it comes back. Wave it over the ball and it comes back. Okay, so again, build it up. Technical skill, might need the whole minute. And then last skill we're gonna do based on this is Foul cow, foul cow. So left foul cow, right foul cow. Again, working from side to side. Those little wavy step overs. Not the same as the Ronaldo, but similar sort of pattern. And again, because it's technical, build it up. If you can do it, great. Now, little challenges for the end of the session. We're going to do some balance work, balancing the ball on our foot, and also some balance circles. So first one, balance circles. So you're going to draw little circles around your standing foot with the other foot, but the other foot is not allowed to touch the ground. If you touch the ground, you're out, or if you have to hold on to something around you in the room, then you're out. Okay, count how many circles. So it's not how just how long but it's how many circles so you're looking for that speed of touches quality of touches to push okay next you would practice the other foot you can see this is my weak foot because it doesn't quite move as well and i'd probably be out without even doing one on that one okay and then last last skill working on our balance again how long can you balance well that's where the skill ball makes it difficult on strong foot and then weak foot. So, not so good, something I would need to, to work on. So there's a little challenge and your coaches may have some extra little fun stuff for you in the session. Yeah, good luck. Hopefully that's explained everything and gives you an idea. If you can master all those skills, get them quicker, get them more comfortable, then you don't have to, your brain doesn't have to worry about the ball and you can start to work on your decisions. So that's where that master the ball, master the game comes in. You've got to be so comfortable with the ball with both feet that then you can focus on playing the game, not worrying about the ball. All right, good luck with those. Hope it goes well. See you next week.